want to say one thing before we continue on because I get it. I get it. I see it already. There's going to be people upset at me because the results probably change. So here we are doing the top five best symmetric skins. Oh, but bro, you whack. The results say this. I don't know what the results say because I am recording this on Monday at 5.51 p.m. And the results say Symmetra got 50% of the votes with 7,718. And Soldier got 49% with 7,714. I do not have time to wait to see what the results are because I'm going on a mini vacation. I am not at my computer by the time you're watching this. I'm out partying, I'm not partying. I'm just at someone else's house. Uh, <laughs> but that means since I'm away on vacation, I have to record this video early, hence why I'm recording it before, way before Saturday. So it's either you don't get a top five video because I waited till the last second to really see the results, but since I'm waiting till the last second, I don't have time to record, edit, get the gameplay for this video, or I can record it early, look at this results and say, yep, we're doing Symmetra. Get the gameplay early, get the visuals early, get the art early, because these take a long time to make. So ain't nobody got time for this. We're doing Symmetra. You shouldn't have waited this long to vote for Soldier. But that's not to say Soldier can't get another opportunity on the polls. So if you guys want to vote in the top right hand corner right now between Soldier 76 and Winston 69, <laughs> you can for next week. However, I'm going on another vacation for Thanksgiving, so that means if you want a top five video for Winston, I have to record it on Monday. In fact, I'll do it the same exact time. Monday at 5.51 p.m. Arizona Standard Time because we don't get daylight savings time. That's when I'll look at the results. If you want to keep me to my word, you can screenshot it, tweet it at me, but only at 5.51, not 5.52, not 5.50, 5. 51 p.m. AZ time. If you live in California, I think it's like 4.51. I don't, <laughs> Symmetra, let's go, baby. Since the intro took too long, we're just gonna dive right into it. The first skin on our list at number five is gonna be one of her first legendary skins, a good legendary skin if you don't have it already, and this is gonna be Goddess. So she received two skins revolving around the same goddess-like theme with Devi and, and Goddess, but at first I had Devi, but I, I went with Goddess because I feel like the, the, the white clothing really does fit her better, especially with the lighter blue skin that she has going on. The dark blue and the red clothes really just clash together with Devi. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Uh, so that's why I went with Goddess. So whenever it comes to these skins that clearly have a backstory, but I'm not smart enough to know the backstory, I try to do a little bit of research to be as correct as possible. So if you're Indian or if you're Hindu, please correct me if I'm wrong. But what this skin is inspired from is from a Devi, hence why there's also another skin that's named Devi. But this is the, the the great goddess, which is a symbol in Hinduism. I think that's where it stems from. In Hinduism, this is just a symbol for a goddess or a woman that is of great stature, that kind of thing. I really hope that's correct. I'm just going to move on before I make myself look stupid. <laughs> but the skin itself, before I move on, it looks fantastic. Something that Overwatch really doesn't do enough is change the hero's skin color. Like with Widow, yeah, they did with Talon from, actually, they did a reverse skin color from blue to white. Here, they changed Symmetra's darker skin tone to have a blue skin tone, which is very unique and very different. But I definitely like the clothes, and the reason why I like this skin more than Davi is the, the luxury white attire that she has going on. She has an awesome crown with a bunch of jewels and she also has skulls on the side. I don't know why they gave her skulls, but there she has it. And then her gun and teleporter is nothing too crazy, but it's definitely a good solid legendary skin if you don't have it already. And since it's year round and only costs a thousand credits, this is a good sim skin to start with. S -s 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 sim skin? <laughs> but the next skin has no backstory. It's either you get it or you live under a rock because I think everybody knows what this is. And this is going to be Vampire. Coming with the 2016 Halloween event came with Symmetra's very first skin, but it was a good solid skin that she first received. One, because it cost 750 credits and if you were sim main, you probably were appreciative of this skin coming in at such a low cost. But the second reason why it's a good solid skin is because well, the color scheme is so poppin', man! This might just be my mind thinking at a 13-year-old level, but honestly, you can never go wrong with a black and red color scheme for Genji, 
for Genji again, and here for Symmetra. And here it's a simple rendition of what a, a vampire would look like, but it's not a vampire where she's like, where she's like, I want to suck your blood. No, she's still like <laughs> Symmetra. Dog, what is this top five video? <laughs> Little tiny details like changing her visor color to have a more translucent red color, also making the headpiece a little bit more pointy, giving her thigh highs with little tiny bats that kind of look like the Skyrim emblem. This is an overall great, cheap event skin. If you don't have it, well, sucks to be you. But now we're getting into the juicy skins for Symmetra. And when you look at these next three skins, you just have to think, man, they really went all out with Symmetra. She is once again, another hero that is totally underrated when it comes to her skin, similar like Zenyatta. And this is definitely shown at number three with Oasis. Coming with the 2017 anniversary event came this, different but very fitting skin. I always try to give a good description of the skin to really describe little tiny details or just to give an overall picture of the skin, but I don't really know where to begin with this. I guess the first thing is gonna be her mask, which, uh, I'm gonna be, how can she see out of it? Okay, there's no little eye holes. It's not like it's translucent. Like, why did they do this? I like it, but I mean, hey, let's be honest. Can Simmons even see to begin with? Hey, yo, controversy, virgin comments commence. But moving on from the road, comments for both you uh, and me the rest of her attire again I don't know how to describe it because it's so futuristic I mean I get it that's what Symmetra is all about she's living in the future her teleporters her, her, her centuries and whatnot even her primary form of fire but even her attire in this skin <laughs> lights colors like even steel somewhere throughout there my god too futuristic for me. But one thing that I love about the skin now that you get to see it more often is her teleporter. I feel like with the first two skins, they didn't really transform it that much, but here they made the base a beautiful flower and it's really fitting because it's blooming a teleporter. That sounds so dumb, but you get what I'm trying to say. I love the teleporter more than the actual skin itself because I don't know, I feel like it's just so beautiful, man. It's way more beautiful than the skin itself. That's not to say the skin isn't, but man, the teleporter just really gets me. I feel like they don't do this enough for Symmetra, and I, that's a big reason why I put this one at number three. But the number two Symmetra skin of all time is gonna be a skin that I kind of went back and forth with, but I, after I looked at both of them, there was a clear-cut winner. So at number two, this is gonna be Magician. Coming with the 2018 anniversary event, Symmetra once again got another skin. I feel like they have have a bunch of Symmetra skins just locked away, but they don't really know when to release them. They have a lot of great ideas, but it doesn't fit the theme of, say, Christmas or the Chinese New Year events. So they just keep giving her skins at the anniversary event. But I really like Magician, all because of the freaking arm, man. With the arm, this is something that they definitely didn't have to do, but whoever thought of this idea, I'm sure people like looked at them and be like, uh, what? But when they actually designed it, they fell in love with it. Everyone fell in love with this skin at the Blizzard office because it's so different, all because of the arm. When it comes to the rest of the skin, it's very simple. They gave her a tuxedo dress kind of thing to make her look more sexy, gave her a top hat, but then the arm, man. And also, <laughs> If you get this Metro Gold gun, you get the uh, golden arm. That's a lie. You don't actually get the golden arm. So while the blue arm is very unique and the outfit works for Symmetra, what I feel like often goes overlooked because of these amazing features are gonna be the gun for Magician. And now again, this isn't anything too crazy, but I, I just really appreciate the little tiny details that they added to the gun. Now, Symmetra's gun is already very small, so they can't add too much to it, but I like the little spade that they have on both sides. And man, when you get the gold gun with this skin and this gun, it looks so, so fantastic, man. The blue arm with the gold contrasts perfectly together. So that's why I feel like I really like this skin. The blue arm along with the gold gun that I have for Sim. Oh. But ladies and gentlemen, it's not the number one best Symmetra skin. I think we all knew this was going to be somewhere high on the list. But I decided to put this at number one. Ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be Dragon coming with the 2017 Halloween event came this monstrosity, this oh my god type of skit for Symmetra. That's literally what I'm calling it. It's an oh my god kind of skin because no one, and I mean no one except for one person at Blizzard could come up with Symmetra being a dragon. I mean, like, honestly, could you have thought, yeah, let's make her a mythical creature that she definitely has no ties in at all, but make her look fantastic. She <laughs> she looks so amazing. And she kind of also reminds me of the dragon from Shrek that Donkey marries. I completely forgot her name, but 
<laughs> she kind of reminds me of her as well. First, let's get it out of the way. The gun. You get a moving dragon eye with dragon scales for the gun. Okay, that's number one. Number two, if you have the gold gun like me, you get a golden dragon gun with dragon scales and a moving dragon eye with the skin. Yes, I just repeated myself, but just replacing with gold. <laughs> Is that not enough for you? Does that not please you enough? Alright, let me kick it up a notch. You get Symmetra as a dragon with this skin. I could end the video right there and I think everyone would be happy, but I'm not because this skin needs a little bit more time. Symmetra needs a little bit more time. She needs more love and appreciation for the kind of skins that she has, especially for a dragon. This is the craziest, the most unique, the most different skin in all of Overwatch. And I love it. Well, the sentries and the teleporter isn't too different. Like, yeah, with the teleporter, you get that same dragon scale effect at the bottom. This skin just screams. Ah! It doesn't scream a phase. It doesn't scream a word. It just screams as if it was a dragon breathing fire. And that was poorly uh, described. But you get what I'm trying to say. This skin is weird, different, unique, creative, creepy, scary, beautiful. All those adjectives is what I would describe this skin. And yes, it's at number one. No, I will not argue with you. Th this is the best Symmetra skin. And if not, one of the best Overwatch skins of all time. You get a freaking dragon gun, Brett. You get a dragon gun! But let me know what you think is the best Symmetra skin of all time. While I will strongly stand by my statement while saying dragon is the best Symmetra skin, I welcome all comments. So, anyway, guys, I love you guys. If you're disappointed that I didn't do Soldier, understand I'm going on vacation. I gotta make these videos. I don't have time to wait for the results. So, if you really want Soldier to win, Monday, 5.51 p.m. is when I'll look at the results, and that's when I'll record the video. So, I love you guys. Thank you guys for watching. More fresh videos to come, and bye.